we'll take out Prince Watts' face, who's... What French you got? Military minds of French blood, so he is a descendant. Ah, he's the heir primitive, so he's not the official heir. I, okay, so the, the prince must be out of sons. Average rich shit, that's lost a lot of troops. Eh, uh, sieges suck. But uh, the army that I've got shit, so I don't particularly mind losing too many of their troops. We'll sack it, just because we can. What do we get? Four units of fear and spearmen in the capital. Eh. Uh, that's not very great. Okay, thanks for that, game. Mission success. That's nice, thank you. Not really. <laughs> it's, it's not much of a fucking gain, that, to be honest, game. There you go. Okay, uh, whether or not we take Metz, it's to, I might wait because sieging that place. You saw how much casualties we lost sieging a, a little city like this. Sieging another thing is just going to be a bloody slaughter, so. I might hold off on it. There you go, and we fit the entire army inside this bit. Which is yay. We'll retrain you and retrain you first. And then afterwards, just. Retrain, 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 retrain. Those guys will stay in there for a little bit. Just keeping these idiotic Frenchmen at bay, basically. Uh, we'll likely play it the safer Honor, way sire. and As you command, starve please. those idiots in Meta. Yep, I do believe that's it for this turn. We won't bother with that because I, well, what's the odds? Your will, sire, we yeah, shall engage. Two to one odds in a very large and well defended castle against decent ish troops. I do not like that, so no, that, that's going to fuck me if I do what resolve with that. And I don't particularly want to, <laughs> I do not want to play that on the battle map, because it will take half an hour to fucking do it and be really boring, and I'll still take heavy casualties. So it's not at all worth it. What's the Papal State doing? The usual gibberish. Nah, we'll starve those bastards out. Give them a slow death. And then we'll go Bolton on them and flay them alive. Flay them living. I almost thought that little French force was going to attack him then. Which would have just been an easy way to kill all those guys. Because if they sally out, I'll fuck them up on open field. I hate siege battles. That is so fucking like... I've done so many of them for Medieval, it's just like, ah, no, no, I can't be bothered. <laughs> it is so long and dull, yeah. My kingdom is looking pretty fucking badass at this point. But it's, it was already badass, but the French are fucked now. Ah! Today, the followers of the Prophet Muhammad rejoice, for Muslim armies have captured the holy city of Jerusalem. Well, that music scared the f***ing shit out of me. <laughs> just, I got headphones on when I record. Uh, so it's just like fucking blurred in my ears for a second. So number three, uh, that's the Kingdom of Aragon, yeah, sure. Death stalks the land, Edinburgh. Great, that's fucking brilliant. Enemy agent Aragon is really starting to piss me off. Carnival promoted, King of Hungary. Recruitment costs, blah, 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 blah. That's nice. I am like the richest SOB on the planet right now. Sire, an honor, sire. Come and fight me, you coward. Um, I might send the gal over there to take up those guys. It's only two turns for them to surrender, so that's not bad. Fleet ready, sire. And then clear out this port. And the grapples and prepare to board. <laughs> Interesting. Those guys have got different port traits for uh. Victory is ours, sire. Fleet ready, sire. Ships ready. Good lord, our fleet is fucking awesome. Look at it. It's just full of, like, the lowest, shittest... <laughs> the shittest-ass uh, ships that you can get your hands on, but... 
boy, is it still badass. Uh, we'll go paved roads for London. Winchester, as usual, can't build shit. We've almost got commercial farming for that place. Wales is doing fine. Although I've got so much money, I may as well build a tanner in, in Wales. Sure, why not? Uh, build Baked House for Nottingham. Get me some more stuff. That place has got some really shitty... Uh... I'll get mines there. Why not? Interest, uh you can have stables. Actually, we'll get you logging camp. Why not? And a logging camp there, because you can. Uh, a logging camp there. Why? Because you can. <laughs> no particular fucking reason. We'll get you a port there. That's nice. What can you get? Um... I get your practice range. And you're still building commercial farms. Parry, what are you doing? Siege works. Fairground, library, blah, 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 blah. school. I think an armorer. Invest in an armorer, and then I can use that to upgrade a bunch of stuff later on. Remy's, what are you up to? Uh, you can get commercial farmland as well. Okay. What can I get under the command of Miguel? Oh, yeah. uh, give him all the units that we've got that aren't completely fucked. Which is most of them, actually. I retrained a lot of them. Tax collection, increased trade, tends to be a patron of the axe, less popular with the people, but also avoids battle. Grant. The capital of Burgundy, known throughout the medieval Europe for its art and music. Sure, Stefan can have that. If he wants it. Yes, noble sire. Assembly hail my king. I will only address you in battle. Quite confident I could take out those guys, sire. maybe. Or I might hold them back for a bit, we'll see. Uh, definitely just going to starve him out at that place. My All your cities are belong to us. 125 men, not too bad at all. And that's one the less city for those guys. Glorious victory. My lord, all mine. Our courage and honor have conquered. boy. Uh, repair you, then repair you, repair you. Just fucking retrain everyone very slowly. Uh, we'll repair that place. That gives us all of that. That means that the French now control merely one region over here. Hail which will starve him out, I imagine. Just leave him be. Or we'll wait till the last turn yes, to do it. Try. I'm pretty sure Come we can fuck up these guys right now. Yes. Ow. Okay, I didn't expect a fucking ambush to spawn. Clear victory, all the same. Only lost 257 troops. Uh, execute. Oh, that could... No, they're, they're not in range of that castle. No way. As you wish. Orders. But, the girls upgraded again. Proven commander. My lord. Looking to be the best commander that England has ever fucking seen thus far. Other than perhaps fucking the Conqueror himself. My lord, yes. An honor, sire. Merging armies, my liege. Oh yeah, the king's in command. <laughs> yes, noble sire. Night fighter, religiously improper, mean leader, renowned victor, proven commander, lacks compassion, social drinker, cruelly the form, virile. Yeah, cool. And every single one of his daughters is fucking useless to me. <sighs> Stupid game. I hate it when it does that. I really do hate it when it does that. 
Because those princes are basically useless. I don't partic I don't want, you know, I'd, I'd, I'd use them mainly just for like uh, diplomatic marriages between allies. But uh, I don't want like foreign non-royal bloodline in my family tree because you can't properly decide who's going to inherit. It goes by authority, and if I do get like a, a choice to adopt, basically, it's basically adopting someone into your family tree by marrying them in, into them. If you do get a good one, then that person likely has high authority, and if you're the guy you, you want to be, it's, it's just a fucking hassle that I like to avoid. <laughs> if at all possible, I shall avoid it. Alright, well, there's fuck all else to do this turn, so we'll end it and see what happens. Hey, we might even get attacked uh, by only you these battle. guys. Here's a possibility. We'll see. Oh, we could easily lift the siege, kill the guys on the outside, and then uh, lay siege again, but I don't want to drag that out too much. If anything, I want the morons to attack me. But yep, that's basically all of France ours now. I could even make them my protectorate if I fucking wanted to at this point. <laughs> nope, they haven't attacked me. I thought they might, but they haven't. I'm still amazed that my king's still alive. <laughs> he's like, he's almost 80 at this point, surely. That's ridiculous. Everyone else is dead. <laughs> He was there at the beginning of all time. It turns out Henry has found the uh, the Fountain of Youth during the conquest of Fran uh, France. Who knew? It was in France. Well, you least suspect to look for things. What the fuck is Norway doing? Laying siege to, no to York, siege Norway? To really? Side. Really? Okay. Yeah, you, you're doing that. You're doing that, are you? Okay. You idiots. You are so fucking dead, Norway. Mark my words. An honor, sire. Orders. Yes. I am the largest faction. Our kingdom has grown to become an empire. For now, you rule the largest area in the civilized world for any major power. The boundaries of our kingdom may be impressive. Take heed as they may become larger, they'll be more costly to defend properly. Yes, we know. Calm down. Edinburgh is still being a bitch. Bunch of commercial farming is done. Dublin needs to be upgraded, and it will be. Henceforth. Forthwith, or whatnot. Forthwith is the word that I was looking for, but, um. <laughs> I only respect it's Prince Olaf, that fucking force of dumbass, bloody Norwegian idiots that showed up earlier, that we killed off, and just sort of. They vanished. Sire. Your will, sire. I will see your head I'm actually not sure if we'll be able to defeat this. The fucking Norwegians may take York. <laughs> they may actually take York. They're not bloody well going to escape when I burn that fucking ship to the ground in a minute, but they may actually take York. It is a possibility. Oh look, it's Prince Thingy. Just standing in the middle of nowhere. I will destroy you for the glory of France. Yes, noble sire. An honor, sire. Sire. Your will, sire. Your will, sire. My lead, my lord. Yes, noble sire. Ah, okay. Yes. So, sire. is the catapult the only reason that those forces couldn't make it there? Your will. An honor, sire. Yeah, it is. Okay. Cool. We'll leave the king behind. Splitting our forces, sire. To battle it is then, sire. Sire, your enemies lie defeated. The girl greets his father. Yes, Glorious victory is ours, sire. Victory! Nothing can stop us, sire. Yes, noble sire. Command me, sire. Hail my king. My king. Command my liege. Hail to be my honest, king. I may even, uh... My liege. Send him in with just the generals and milk myself some traits. 
it might be worth doing. An honor, sire. Yes, noble sire. Yes, my liege. Yes, noble sire. Yeah, that might actually be worth it. Uh, we shall see. This place is kind of dodgy right now. I don't like the looks of it. Put you on low. My king. Put line clearance in there. What the fuck are you doing in here? El Chid de Lombardy. <laughs> it's El Diablo. Come up from the Moors lands to be a bitch. Alright, you've convinced me. I'll start building some defenses against you. We shall see. Uh, it should easily be done, basically. I can bring Stefan uh, over with me. They'll wish they'd never been born, sire. Such is the fate of all who oppose us. Command me, sire. We shall... Sire. Yes. Hmm. Your will, sire. My lord. Orders. My lord. Yes, sire. Combining forces, sire. Command me, sire. Yes, sire. No, we can't take out that yet. Yes, noble sire. Um. An honor, sire. Hail my king. Yeah, if I send the king over. Honor, sire. As you will, my king. I might take this place as it is. Three to one odds. Twenty bucks says the game still fucks me though. Louis is doing whatever the hell. Comte Campania, yeah, the city is known as the cathedral where the French kings were crowned. And aspires national piety. Yeah, you're not that because it's mine now, bitch. But uh, either way, let's see if the game screws me. Oh, clear victory. I did lose 800 men, but that's not too bad. I definitely won't find that on the map, though. <laughs> By God's will, we have triumphed! Uh, we shall sack it for good money. The King of France is dead. And the Cardinal is dead. Another Cardinal is dead. Another Cardinal's dead. I like to I like to think that all of these Cardinals committed suicide <laughs> upon hearing that their beloved France has fallen to the dogs. Okay, uh, all I need to do now is basically retrain all my forces. I don't believe I'm at war with anyone on my direct borders now. It's just a bunch of idiotic douchebags. Uh, and also, naturally, the Norwegians that we need to fucking deal with, which we'll do now. Okay, guys. It would appear that we're actually going to lose York, because... Yeah, his forces, these house cars are just badass. I should have tried more to sink them. But yeah, it would appear the Norwegians are going to sack York. But they are not going to get away with it. Yes, my lord. Because they have nowhere to run. But yeah, uh, I'm recruiting as much as I can around the general regions of this, just in case they decide to do anything else. But they might not even attack this turn, although they do have siege equipment to pull it off. I will see your head rest atop a pike, outlander scum. Anyway, we'll uh, we'll end the turn after this. I uh, mean, the next turn we just need to deal with all of our forces and retrain and everything. Since the the conquest is done, we just have to survive now and uh, hopefully that no one will declare war on us or anything. I mean the Western Roman Empire is my ally as is Denmark. The Moors have, declared, have attacked me twice and asked for peace twice. The Aragon guys who are slightly to the south and at the moment getting their asses kicked by the Moors keep trying to send agents against me but they aren't attacking me. Byzantine, ask me for a uh, trade. Seriously. I want a trade. You give me a trade? No? Okay. The Byzantines are douchebags. <laughs> How dare they not want it? What are you doing? Ugh. And they're attacking me. Yep. Stupid, stupid, stupid. The enemy has surrounded Typical. Us. Well, there you go. Remember what I was saying like two seconds ago about the fucking moors? <laughs> and people attacking me. Yeah, there you go. Ah. 
That's fine. They want war. They'll get their fucking war. Now this, we will fight on the map. Purely because I want to kill as many of them as I fucking can. Maybe get lucky. Death to the Norwegian cunts! My lord, only half our force remains. Yeah, yeah, I know. What can I say? The Vikings are badasses. Our army is tiring. My lord preserve us. We've been dealt a stinging defeat today. Well, that was totally worth it. Well, Prince Olaf has taken York. Excellent. We probably would have got away with killing more of them if we just stuck on the defensive, actually. What I should have done is just sent out one unit to, like, beat the crap out of their ladders. Then held up the rest of them back at the, uh, at the gates. But oh well. York has fallen. Great. They will pay for this. At least they haven't exterminated the populace or our port would be destroyed. The King of France is dead. Yeah, we know that. The King of France has been dead for ages. Can that do Aston? No. No. The Pope is dead. Woohoo! Pope elected. Pope. Yay. You have been reconciled. Yes. Good news indeed. The Pope has sent an emissary to notify you the willingness to reconcile differences. Not exactly great timing, because uh <laughs> Who wants to bet that the new Pope demands that I Cease my siege on York. Yes. Orders. Your will, sire. Maybe we should. No. If he asks me to cease my siege on York, I will. Yes, I will do the fuck over my middle finger. Sire. Fuck him. They've invaded my lands. I'm more than happy to be nice and peaceful after I reclaim my fucking territory. Seriously, I'm more than happy to be peaceful now. But for the love of God, Pope, do not try and make me... What the? There's a witch. The unexplained. Go away, witchy. But no, do, do not fucking try to demand that I don't take my fucking lands back. They did exactly what it's going to do. I know it's exactly what the fucking Pope is going to do. You just absolutely know that's going to happen. <laughs> There's no way that's not going to happen. Hey, Stefan finally had a kid. So his line will continue. Slowly and surely. Oh, I think you're the ugly. He's still kicking ass. Alright, we'll, uh, we'll sort out my military forces off camera, I suppose. All right, guys. I've moved around all my uh, my stuff, basically. Oh, by the way, I forgot to mention the previous turn. We've uh, re renamed this place to Harold Hall, which is like Harren Hall, but Harold Hall, named after the uh, the king's uh, favored son, I suppose. Who did take it as well? He was sieging it for ages. So, yes. My king. Uh, we've got for, uh, York on the siege. Like I said, the Pope's probably going to tell us to stop. In which case, he can go fuck himself. Because it's my land. I'm not just going to stop. I it's never going to happen, I'm afraid. Cut from you first, uh, Once I capture you, your title will mean nothing. This place is likely going to fall, but we'll try and kill as many of them as we can before that happens. What I've done is I've sent... What the hell? There was a fucking... I just saw some... Grenetian guys, like, right next to one of my castles. I'm gonna be annoyed if they attack me as well. But yeah, what I've done is I've sent most of the shitty in, like, mercenary forces off with, uh, Harlan's kid. Oh, Harold's kid, not Harlan. Harold's kid. And, um, I left the, like, really beaten up professional forces off with, uh, Off at Harold Hall to be retrained. But you see, they got those 
Jiranis guys right next to Claremont, whatever the hell that was called. But yeah, we've likely got a siege here, which we'll lose. But uh, we'll try and kill as many of them as we can in the process. I really seriously hope the Pope doesn't try anything stupid like telling me not to reclaim my own territory. Especially from the Norwegians, who are basically fucking pagans and all that name. Alright, we'll do this. Fight on the battle map. May as well try and kill as many of them as we can. The enemy have ladders at the walls. Why are you not using fire arrows? Give them steel. Hey, that's caught fire. Excellent. Fucking brilliant work. That worked a lot better than I thought it would. Well, here they come. It'll be a miracle if they hold. <laughs> Come on, can't you guys shoot from up there? Something changes in the course of battle, but defeat seems almost certain. Lord have mercy, we've lost half of our men. Please attack! Look, you've got a fucking direct line to shoot the fuckers from right up there. Well, we managed to kill 600 or so of them, which ain't too bad. I still really fucking wish we could have. We could have actually managed to get away with like. Maybe killing the, the general if my forces were smart enough to shoot at the enemy rather than standing still like, Oh, uh, uh, what, what do we do? What, what do we do? Welcome to Medieval 2 AI. The most retarded thing on the fucking planet. <laughs> it's really fucking bad sometimes. Like, really bad. Well, we lost that. Great. <laughs> Uh, and then there's a giant fucking Genoese Italian army right next to my shit as well. Which is nice. Greetings. Our people Trade have rights, something certainly. glad to agree on you. Farewell, noble one. So, who wants to bet that the Pope has demanded that I don't reclaim my own territory? Place your bets. Place your bets. <laughs> And cue the threat of excommunication. Hmm? Oh, Stefan's dead. Nope. It doesn't appear. Nope, it does not appear that, uh... Sweet. Nope, it doesn't appear that the Pope has declared that I must step down from... thing. Order. Marching to war. F fucking four to three odds. That's gonna screw me or something, isn't it? Are the, are the, is Norway a Christian state? 
Yeah, it's Catholic. So, hmm. I thought it would, but apparently not. Yes. Marching, sir. Anyway, he'll go back down there. These guys are at uh, Harrenhold. Well, they'll slowly get retrained. And I'm sending more and more troops over the garrison the place also. My leash. Fucking Henry's still alive. He's 83. 83. <laughs> you know, for a man that's been screwing it to the Pope. His entire life. Um, he doesn't seem to be at all bothered with the idea that God might not be happy that he's fucking with the Papal Empire. I, d d just, just pointing that out. The enemy of the Pope for so many years has managed to outlive everybody.